it up, trap. What's going on YouTube? Zach co-owner Soul Priorities. We're in Pineville, North Carolina. It's right out of Charlotte, like 15 minutes. We're doing a video, another behind the scenes video. Not a whole lot of stores uh, do kind of behind the scenes videos of how a store actually runs and then everything that goes into running a good store. We're showing you stuff that we're doing before open, after close, stuff we're doing throughout the day to make the store run as smooth as it does. This is Connor, general manager, Soul Priorities. You guys have seen me quite a few times on the channel, but but yeah, like Zach said, we're Man, he loves felines. <laughs> I do love felines. I hope you guys enjoyed my shirt. I have another one cooking up for you guys. Did you put that on Instagram, app? Yeah, Josh sent it to oh, me. Yeah, that's a good one. Um, probably got my identity stolen, but it's all right. Um, but no, we're gonna show you what it takes to run a shoe store. Get here, got here early, Geo came in, filmed us, showed you guys a few things, but we'll take you throughout our course of our day. So enjoy the video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned to these videos. If you are beginning reselling or you're trying to open up your own store we are giving you so much free game like we really should be charging for this but for the people stay tuned to the channel man and comment below what kind of stuff you want to see we're pretty open about a lot of stuff so tell us what to do next i'm game for uh, anything store related tell me what to do let's get to it what's first uh bait purple pillow that was a questionable buy. I feel like if we had a place to, I feel like we had a place to display that, it might would do better. Those new display cases are going to hit. Yeah, facts. The new display cases will be nice. Chrome Hearts, Las Vegas, trucker hat black. Gallery department, Hollywood hat. So we are actually, past six months, we have been working on our own inventory management system. A lot of stores have been switching over to light speed. We wanted to take ours a little bit farther. Started from scratch, got our own inventory management app. What we're doing now, it's the most boring, manual tedious. process, tedious oh ever. But we're going through each individual item in store. So like every single hat that has a tag on it, right? Matching it with our spreadsheet to make sure the inventory is right. And then we're uploading the inventory tonight. Um, if you want to come around. How is this better than the old system? It could be a lot more hands off, thankfully. It's completely automated as far as like sales logging. All you have to do to input an item is just type in the SKU number from the manufacturer, puts out a picture on the website. Clothing will now be on the website. Everything that's in the store is gonna match what's online. It's gonna be flawless. Before, if we wanted to put a shoe in inventory, you literally have to do this. 05, what's today, the 23rd? 22, chrome parts hat. Purchase price 420, new sale price 500. You'd have to copy that into here. And then print this label export, and that makes you an individual tag. It doesn't seem like a lot, but when you do that 5,000 times, it's really tedious. I mean, we have two people that do 40 hour a week inventory. So we just grenaded the website. So we have no products right now. We're uploading white air forces as we speak, but we have no products. So <laughs> as of <laughs> right now at 1040, there's nothing on the website. <laughs> this is also going to be an overnight yeah, fiasco. Yeah, we, we got here at 7 p.m. Um, myself, Connor, Tavares, Josh, Derek, Joanna, who else? Zay, uh, Key. Hands. Didn't work today. We're all working 7 to 7 p.m. to probably 3 p.m. tomorrow. Yeah. To make sure it's, it's gonna be like 16 good hours. for you. The things we do. The things we do to run a store. Running your own store is not easy. And we're actually closed right now. As you probably saw on the computer, it's like 1040. So. Dang. And then we're not opening until 3 p.m. tomorrow to ensure that everything is accurate for everybody that comes into the store. Two Hollywood hats. Another Hollywood hat. Boy, yeah. that hat is amazing. That hat pays. Can I see that hat? Great hat. It's got a bunch of different colors. You can match it with a lot of tees. That's the key. You can wear this hat with 30 different outfits. Eight blue trucker hats. Think we have enough of those? Two. No. <laughs> What is that? Uh, regular Walmart's Hollywood. Hollywood. <laughs> and then a camo Hollywood. 
trucker. It says Chrome Hearts Trucker Hat Camera. Hold on, I don't even think I have that Hollywood. Can you actually, can you type that? Yes. It is Chrome Hearts Hollywood Trucker Hat Black. 485. Okay, so I already highlighted one of those. It was this one. Oh, that's the Vegas one? Yep. Okay. We're four hours into the inventory. All we've done is clothing. We have to be done by 3 p.m. So I wonder, hopefully we can get it all done. 16 hours, 18 hours to finish all this. We should. 18 hour overnight shift. Not going on any crazy vacations. Still in the store. Not much changed in a year. <laughs> Too many store owners, man. They, like, people, they like, open up stores and then it's. First three years of any small bro, business. Eight months into the store, they're taking a vacation every weekend. Like, bro, you haven't made it. You have one store, three stores, two stores. You gotta stay down, man. Down until you come up. I'm still driving the Honda, bro. So is he. I was about to say, if you want something about Honda, I probably have the worst car of any store manager, GM of any shoe store in the country right now. I'm driving a 2011 Honda Civic. Brakes are so bad on it when you press the brake. <laughs> really good. I don't have air conditioning. Um, two of my four windows don't work. Hey, man. I'm a, I'm a fairly and there's still cheap. a recall out on your there's airbag. There's a recall on there. I'm a cheap guy, man. I don't, I don't need a eighty thousand dollar car. It gets me from point A to point B. All I simple do is man. Q simple man. All I do. Is Babe, college mesh cap camo. Babe, college mesh hat red. Another good, another good hat. Chrome Hearts horseshoe hat black. <laughs> that is dusty. <laughs> Somebody brings us lunch. You can have this hat. <laughs> Supreme. We have so many accessories, but we can't sell them. Like, and then they get all dusty. We used to display them up there, but people steal the Chrome Hearts <laughs> hats, so we can't display four hundred dollar hats. We have to lock them in cases, but our cases can barely fit the shoes we have. <laughs> oh. Supreme small box logos. All right, so this is what happens when we don't have something. So this item either got stolen or we forgot to log the sale. So for accessories, one, we had that. So delete that, don't have that. Don't have that. Don't have that. Don't have that. We have all those. One eternity later. All right, Key. What yep. time is it? It's like 9:35. 9:35. How long have we been here? Like 14 hours. 14 hours. The place looks like a mess. It's supposed to open in <laughs> one hour. <laughs> no chance. Connor, down for the count. Yeah. No amount of energy drinks will revive me. We're at two or three energy drinks apiece. Finished all the inventory, now we're just updating it into the new system. And she is a rough one. <laughs> <laughs> she is a rough one, fellas. It's, it's tough. It's complicated this getting job is started. Not for the weak. Not for the faint of heart. Chill, bro. That's my dad's hog, bro. You're supposed to get my dad's Hour 15. How are we feeling? Mm. Ready to sleep, go home. But still chugging away. It's the only thing you can do. What's on foot today? Oh, no surprise. He's got the potters on. Yeah. Never true. Shit, Tavares is good side. What's up? What up? You ready to get it? Oh yeah. What time is it? It is uh, game time. 2.13. Yeah. Gotta get some IG pictures, man. Uh oh. Did the inventory yesterday, so we ain't post nothing. How'd that go? Not even done with it yet. How you think it's gonna end up? Make it make the website more accurate. I f***ed up yesterday, big guy. It's about 6.30 in the morning. He goes, oh man, I can't sit in this chair any longer. I'm going to sit in my car. And I'm, I literally, I'm like, oh, he's going to sleep. 
Go out there 15 minutes later, head against the window, phone <laughs> car on, lights out. We should have brought the camera, and then Key was also like, we should have opened the door, so we fell out. Jeez, Key, you would have keep ran on my downfall, man. This was this was try number one. Good take right here, but our checkout counter is uh busted. Dingy. Dingy. So gotta retake it. Me no out. checkout counter. Hey guys, Joanna here. I just wanted to give y'all a little rundown of how I make sure the floor looks good before either closing or opening. When we close shoes, we always gotta make sure they are straight, organized. We gotta make sure it tags our face this way. I always put out displays before we close, just so the next day we can have all displays out. We also gotta make sure that cases are cleaned. We also gotta make sure mirrors are clean, the store is swept. We also gotta make sure that the clothes is organized in and size order. So the next day people don't see a small and a medium section. We also gotta make sure that the used wall looks good. Got some little good deals on some used shoes. I also gotta make sure that the counter looks nice. When we buy a lot of stuff, the counter tends to get messy. When we close, we always make sure that the register is nice and clean for the next day. That's it. <laughs> What's up guys? So in the morning, sometimes it can be a little hectic. Today's a little easier because we have a few people here, so it makes it easy. So for example, right now, a customer texted our store phone. They wanted to see pictures of our worn once flu game. Great condition, 2016. Beautiful shoe, very fair price at 340. Boxes in great condition. So I just shot him over a few pictures. Hopefully he gets to take something home today. Every morning, I normally get here at about 8.30. What I end up doing, I go through sales from the day previous, make sure everything checks out. I will We'll get set up for the day so i'll set up the calendar for the day the schedule um, i will kind of write out a to-do list of things that we need to like top priority check off for the day i'll make sure we have money to buy shoes for the day so make sure we have an adequate amount of money here in the store i'll box up any kind of online orders that we have print them out get them boxed up get them ready to ship for ups to come pick up other odds and ends like if i notice the bathroom has to be picked up and cleaned or the back room's looking a little messy organize a few things but that's a lot of what it takes to even just open up a shoe store for for the day so we open at 11 so it takes me about a solid two and a half hours to get the store ready to go each morning so it's not you know just all fun and games here at the old sp there's a lot of it's not just involved. shoes and cash it's not just shoes and cash there's a lot of behind the scenes stuff that is involved um just to even get ready to open up at 11 that doesn't even include anything that we do throughout the course of the day as well I'm making magic over here store be so busy during the day got to get the instagram pictures before we open it's terrible trying to get pictures I would agree with that. Because then also you have shoes, you have full sets of shoes out. We'd never be able to get a picture like this when we were open. Yeah, people just snag walk by, that. snag like 20 pair of kids Yeezys. That'd be good. Yeah, what y'all doing here? One of Abe's. Oh, these on sale? One of <laughs> Abe's guys brought these in yesterday. What you thinking about Big Zebo? Where's my phone? How many times a week do you lose your phone? Phone and wallet 10 times a week, easy. I've never met somebody lose that loses their wallet. You gotta get an air tag, bro. Have you seen this? Yeah, you do need to get that. You leave it in the back, you want to get Come on, let's see if we can find it. Hey, Gio, you're going to have to insert some. <laughs> <laughs> Music right here, looking for this one. Thank you, finding out in a minute. Oh, it's actually still recording. Oh, yeah. come on now. She's here. Oh, well. 704 celebrity. Not a celebrity. Big guy. Two people, two people noticed me in public yesterday. They're like, ooh, so priority. Yeah, it's AIDS. I went to go pick up wings one time and I had a hoodie on with it <laughs> up and a beanie. And the guy's like, oh, you managed so priorities. I'm like, give me my fucking wings. Hey, good morning, Kanye. Shut the fuck up. Let me go home. It was like nine o'clock and I, I take it different. Oh. Like it. Okay, so people, if you see Connor, just give a nod and keep it moving. <laughs> if you see Zach, say, something. say what's up. That makes my day. Man. Acknowledge him. I love all my customers, but when I'm out, I'm not work. I'm probably with my girls. When he's with his boo, love. Alone. Yeah. Look at that. That's a beautiful picture. To make sure the angle's right. So, got a pair of shorts in. 
I'm not sure if anybody, any of y'all have ever used Grailed. Have you ever used Grailed for personal stuff? Have you ever used Grailed? Yes. So the Grailed listing for these shorts is listed as brand new. You got some doo doo stains? Brother. <laughs> oh. These have been like heat washed. Yeah. The the P and T gone, the A and the L gone. One of the L's and then Y is gone. So I'm gonna charge back on PayPal and ship these back with Grail. Do a claim. Yeah, you can tell they're not. Yeah, look at them. They look dingy. Dusty. What's up, y'all? YouTube. Wanna give another shout out to my family. Kim, love you. Ava. Congrats on EOGs, Camden. We're going to kindergarten, big dog, you know what I mean? We're gonna have a great summer, a lot of family trips, probably come to soul parties, put y'all to work, you know what I mean? Get some of my money back. What we got going on here, Connor? This is Aaron, good friend of ours. We used to work together, he's worked with quite a few people here in the store. Oh, um, kid shoes? Little DS kid shoes. Little oh, what size is that? Eight. Eight, never mind. My son's, a, my son's a 10. Oh, never mind. That's a 10. You can get him a 9. Yeah, I don't like 9. I actually just brought in 11 of those like two days ago. So, I used to like this shoe. I don't like it anymore. It's nice. It's nice. It's the leather on it is really nice. See, it's the better thing better is, ice that's ice like the... That's the first time they started doing the Jordan 1 toddler shoes in like exact same form as the high tops. Yeah. So that's what really like kicked it off. So that's why I like it. My son has that pair. Um, but I like it because it's exactly like a regular Jordan 1 highs. There's no like Velcro, nothing. Thank you, sir. Always good to see you. What you been up to? Okay, Always good to see you. Always. Be safe. Tell everybody I said Y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Oh, it is so hot. Oh, I'm cooking in this What's shirt. the temp today? It's supposed to be 95. That's it's probably 80-something right now. She's a sweaty one for sure. I might go home and go to the pool. Just dip out. We got Conrad here today, chasing oh, here. It was so crowded. Full staff. Oh, yeah, this is beautiful. Christmas tree needle. It's probably not. Can you move them? Can you invert them? So I don't have to move the camera? No. Nope. Move them to the right. Well, that's the left. Tilt them a little towards me. Boom. What it takes to run a sneaker store. What it takes. You have to know your left from your right. I don't, clearly. Hold them like over here. Try to hold them like separate. I'd like to not get your gray Nike shorts in the picture, no offense. If you had some cool EEs on, like me, bro. I have to take shorts with your thumb. These are cool, like, outdoorsy shoes, so. I'd wear these on a hike, the brown ones. Especially. Yeah, what in the world? Go hike Crowders? You wanna go do that? Bro, you know what we should do today? I'd be down for hiking. We should dip early and go play freaking tennis. Oh, it's gonna be so hot. Dude. I'm down to dip early though, to be honest with you, bud. Morning gets off at five. I just have to beat five o'clock traffic. I cannot sit there. As I don't know if you guys have heard, I drive a dumpster of a car. I am too lazy and cheap to buy another one. So my car doesn't have air conditioning. We're also just like modest, reasonable people. Yeah, I don't. We would rather invest more in the store than buy a bunch of flashy cars and Mary jeans. I don't want to spend 50K, 60K on a car that I literally just go to work and I don't do anything outside of work. So it seems like a big waste of money in my opinion and I want to buy a house. So I'd rather put 50K towards a house than 50K. Yeah, you gotta wait for that market crash. So if anybody wants to fix my AC for free, that's cool. I'll buy the parts. You just have to fix it labor free. You're, you're putting a lot of feelers out there for free stuff in the YouTube videos. You think someone will actually give you something? Maybe one day. It might not happen today. It might not happen this year. It might happen next year. I Someone's like definitely going to give them something eventually. I mean, if it's free, it's for me. I stand corrected because I trashed these shoes. They're also, when, when I was trashing them, they were going for like a thousand bucks. Yeah. So. I mean, do you like the Air Maxes though? 
I'm not a big not a big Air Max. I'm got. I'm not a big fan of the Air Maxes. I like. I think I like this. These better. I don't like the Air Maxes. I don't really like any of those shoes. Unfortunately, I wanted to like them. I just not doing it for me. <laughs> must cop, man. He's a must cop, man. Must and cop. cop the T to go with it. Yeah. <laughs> Cop and fits at SC. Shout out Matt. You got, you got the joggers. Gotta get Shout those. out Matt. Shout out Matt. That's my <laughs> dad right there. Bape, no one. He's copping the babe tee, the motive pants. The easy slides like this. Oh, oh yeah. Dance. Babe got the easy. Something for everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We, they watch the videos too. Always, oh, yeah, for always. Sure. And we, we on really IG. They're trying we to give everybody the juice. You need to tap in when they give them the matter juice. Matter of fact, out. matter of fact, I'm oh, finna go get my. Yes, yeah, sir. It's 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 there. I'm just finna get it. It's only right. Definitely. So priority. Gotta get it. They have a new location coming. Tap in. Oh yeah. New location. We got Reek, we got G, came in here looking to get a gift for their homie, so we gonna get them right today, laced up with some new kicks. The Reek Blazer, you already know, take us on. Yeah, follow me on Instagram, like I said, Reek Blazer, R-I-I-Q-B-L-Z-I-N. You already know, man, with my bro, came in G Money. Follow me at Savage, underscore Savage Man, underscore, take us on, you feel me? New music coming out, and it's my nigga, Tate Birthday, you feel me? Yeah, Juice Aker, Gemini, you getting bro, it right with some pants. Bro, always get us right, you feel me? Always get me right. Gonna pick these up and some forces, so yeah. Gotta get right. Gotta tap in. Had to, bro. Hey, we're here with Walker, one of my young customers. Hello. And uh, Connor built quite a rapport, you know what I mean? But, yeah, what's your Instagram? It's. Here, I'm checking. Uh oh. Charlotte underscore sneaker kid. Give him a follow. Yeah. We'll go ahead and pop her in the video. Get that, Walker. Got yeah. some heaters on. Him and him and Connor. Yeah. Little pal. Yep. What's going on guys? We appreciate you sticking around and watching the whole video with us. We uh, dropped a lot of free game for what it takes to run a sneaker store day to day, how to open up, stuff like that. So we appreciate you guys watching with us. Um, if there's anything that you want to see in the future, good to see you guys. Appreciate you, my boy. If there's anything you want to see in the future, let us know in the comments below. And as always, we're open 24-7. SoulPriorities.com, SoulPriorities.com, SoulPriorities.com. Or you can pull up on us, Carolina Place Mall. Pineville, North Carolina. I mean, come check us out. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. YouTube, Instagram, TikTok. What else? Come see us in store. We're open 11 to 7, Monday through Thursday, 11 to 8, Friday and Saturday, and 12 to 6 on Sundays. We're happy to take care of you however you need. We appreciate you guys sticking with us, watching another video. We hope you have a great week, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace.